welcome in to Sunday Sermons. Take a sip of, you know, instead of drinking, uh, you know, wine from the pulpit, we'll just uh, drink water. Um, as you may or may not know, well, if you had Sunday Sermons, you actually do know, uh, we read uh, every Sunday. This is our scripture, our book of scripture. Uh, there's very, there's varied uh, editions. This is the, I'm being from the, uh, United Independent Compensatory Code System Concept. Uh, it's, a it's a compensatory counter-racist code by Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. And this is the uh, 2016 uh, Revised Expanded Edition. I am Neely. And you should know that uh, this is a textbook workbook for thought, speech, and or action for victims of racism white supremacy. If you're not a victim, then this book is not for you. And again, uh, even though this says it's a textbook workbook for us, uh, us being the uh, acolytes of liberation, this is our scripture. So every Sunday we read from our scripture. Uh, so this, this, this Sunday we're going to uh, the first area of activity, and there are, uh, there are several areas of activity. And they are in, uh, I guess, alphabetical order, uh, economics, education, entertainment, labor, law, uh, politics, as, politics, as mis defined by Mr. Needle Fuller Jr., is um, people relations, um, religion, sex, and war, counterwar. Now, we're reading from page uh, 63, and... Uh, He, uh, there's a uh, uh, question. Actually, we're going to read uh, two questions and two answers, I guess. Um, uh, question. What is the best and correct thing to say about people who beg? We're in economic times, so you know what that means. People are born begging. This is Mr. Neely Fuller Jr.'s answer. People are born begging. And if they exist long enough, they will spend their last days begging. And the second question is, uh, what is the best and correct thing that a person should be willing to beg for? If you're begging all your life, especially at the end of your life, what should you beg for? The answer Mr. Neely Fuller Jr. gives in this, in his uh, United Independent Compensatory Code System concept, which we call the code, uh, is... The answer uh, to uh, what is the best and correct thing that a person should be willing to beg for? The answer, justice. And justice is a, is a balance between people. Which means to guarantee that no person is mistreated and to guarantee that the person who needs help the most gets the most constructive help at all times and all places in all areas of activity. Remember those uh, nine areas of activity that, that, that we went through for all those areas. Yeah, that's like economics, um, uh, education, entertainment, law, labor, politics, um, religion, sex, and war, counter-war. I don't know if that war, counter-war fits into... Uh, justice because, uh, you know, war gets messy. <laughs> Whereas everybody quotes Mike Tyson, hey, everybody has a plan to, to that first punch, you know, punch gets you. So, there you go. Uh, and then he has a, 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 a thing he says under there. Uh, uh, choose to beg. I mean, those are, the, those are two questions and answers. Uh, and then he has a, well, let's see, let's see, those are two question and answers. Yeah, then he has this Thing, this highlighted thing here. I'm just going to read that. I'm not going to read. I'm not going to read the explanation. You should get the book from ProduceJustice.com, and then you go to page 63 and find out whatever he says there. Okay, choose to beg for those things produced by the work of others rather than to rob or steal. Never choose to rob or steal. Instead, go to a white person who you have no reason to believe can be of some help and ask for the constructive help that is needed. Repeatedly ask for such help. 
from white people and avoid asking for such help from non-white people. Oh, I got to read this one again. Oh, we got, in fact, we might have to talk about this. Hold on a second. I'm not talking, I'll talk at you, right? Choose to beg, that's in uh, parentheses, choose to beg, for those things produced by the work, that's in parentheses, in the quotes too, of others, rather than to rob or steal. Never choose to rob or steal. Okay, don't do that. Instead, go to a white person who you have reason to believe can be of some help and ask for the constructive help that is needed. Okay, now let me just stop right there. Ask, ask, ask. You know, we got to, everybody's into reparations these days. I guess it's fall under reparations, but I don't know if you want to. Uh, well, well, they have they, they can help because they caused the problem. Let's put it that way. So I'll leave it at that one. Now, this is the last sentence: repeatedly ask for such help from white people and avoid asking for such help from non-white people. You know, so now that put the reparation thing is that's right. So let's leave it there for this uh, for this Sunday sermon. Uh, again, uh, the, 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 the book in various uh, alliterations and uh, editions uh, can be gotten from ProduceJustice.com. Go there and uh, pick up the book for yourself. That's just some advice from me. T from the Pattersons, taking the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect.